Hello guys, in this video, I'm gonna be going through how to create a report for the VMs that are using Azure Backup. And this was a request from one of our customers. So the first thing that I'm gonna be using, I'm gonna be doing it directly in Azure. So there's no remote authentication or anything like that that you have to worry about. Uh, and I'm gonna be using the Cloud Shell. How to use it is beyond uh, this video. I'm just gonna show you really quick how you can do that. So on the top, uh, left let's see here you see right here this is the icon for cloud shell uh, so what you're going to do is you're going to click on it and that uh, will open and what we're going to do is that i'm going to download a set of scripts that i already created for this purpose and the way to do it is that in your cloud shell you have something called the cloud drive that allow you to see files and you can download them very easy so I'm gonna leverage that. So how do we get that? First thing that you're gonna do, as you can see here, I'm gonna do CD Cloud Drive. And from right there, anything that you write in the Cloud Drive, you can download it very easy. And you wanna see this. So we're gonna download the scripts. Uh, I have a couple of scripts that I started compiling together. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna download those scripts. So if you go to carlosvargas.com forward slash Azure scripts, that will download the scripts to your computer. In this case, we're downloading directly into Azure. So you do wget the URL dash o Azure script, and I'll put the link under this. When you download, that will download the scripts to the location. So if we do an ls, you're gonna see that there's a file called Azure script.zip. All that we have to do is unzip that file. So unzip. Azure scripts and that will export the current scripts that they are. So you see there's a couple of scripts in there and what we're going to do is that one of them going to create a report, the other one going to go through every VM in your Azure environment so we can see if they have Azure backup. So let's go into Azure scripts, then Azure backup. And this will give you the two scripts and what you're going to do is dot create Azure backup report. And it need to be done like that because one of the requests was, if you have more than one subscription, it's gonna go through each Azure subscription enumerating all the VMs. So right there is enumerating the scripts. It went through, found my first subscription, and now it's going through each one of those VMs, checking to see if they have Azure backup. And you're gonna see some of them say yes, other ones say no. And the cool thing is that this will end up as a CSV that then you're gonna be able to download to your computer. So let's wait a little bit. There's about probably like 20 to 30 VMs in there. So it's going through all of them. Okay, so now that this finished, where do we find that file? So you're gonna see in your resource groups, now here on the top, let me turn off Cloud Shell. You're gonna see here that it says Cloud Shell and your area, and you're gonna be able to go into your storage account. And from there, you can go into file shares. And you're gonna see your file share created and then from here, you're gonna find, you remember that was Azure script main, Azure backup, and there we have our CSV. All that we have to do is click on the file, and now we can download that file to our desktop. Okay, so now what we have to do is take the file, open it, and now in here we have the VM name, we have the location, we have the resource group, and here's the location for if the VM is getting backed up with Azure Backup. If you wanna get some additional details, like the recovery vault that it is, and the policy. So you have all that information in here. I hope this has been helpful. If you have any questions, please let me know.